everybody welcome back to the channel pink's adventures here today we are riding a 2022 heritage 114 super comfy position super super comfy and i gotta say for once i actually kind of like the i kind of actually like these stock bars i think on these heritage they call them i think they're the mini apes I guess they're, I think they're around 10 inches, I'm not sure. You're right, this bike is very fast. <laughs> the 114 in this light little frame, I'm going to say it pulls good. And it does. <laughs> And I don't know, is there anything such any such thing as a motorcycle that isn't fun? If there is, I have never found one. Uh where's the indicator light for this thing? Oh, it's all right on the tank, okay. Yeah, uh gotta say these bars actually aren't too bad. Not sure how much different they are from the other touring bars, but definitely feels better soft tail so it's got the mono shock in the back there and I gotta say uh, the soft tail does have a even with the stock suspension does have a much nicer ride than the uh, the big touring bikes pulls good at speed nice torque uh, the windshield is actually providing quite a bit of wind protection. I don't feel anything on my shoulders. Uh, little to no wind buffeting on the helmet. And uh, well, I'm I'm five nine, so I don't know if you were six foot or taller. What the wind buffeting would be like, or it could be any. I don't know. For me, there's little to none say these uh, smaller frame bikes with the, uh, the 114 and the 117 and the man there's crazy fun you can really feel the torque you can definitely chew up some miles on this thing on the highway nice and comfy really liking the uh, soft tail suspension it's uh, for a stock suspension it's it's actually pretty nice this heritage got just got a nice classic look to it not sure what the colors are it's some sort of blue and black <laughs> really nice combo bike looks really sharp this one has short mirrors as well but they don't seem to affect your hands as much it's almost like the the grips are more sloped away from the uh, from the mirror. They're not quite as tight into the mirror. The seat is nice. Uh, again, a rider backrest would be super nice. I just I'm spoiled with that thing. I have it on my uh, my uh, ultra limited, and yeah, I just, I just notice it when it's not there now. Kind of almost feels like it needs a little more gear. Um, I'm in fifth gear. We're doing 100 kilometers an hour. Uh, I don't know. What the, I don't see a tachometer. I don't know how to get that up. But um, 100 kilometers an hour feels a little bit buzzy. I can feel quite a bit of vibration in the handlebars and. I notice once once you go to six, uh, six is way too tall. You start like at this speed. If I go to six, now it almost kind of feels like it's chugging along, lugging the engine. I'm sure if we weren't in a group, you could find a uh, a speed in those gears that would make it more comfortable. I have to keep my foot 
way out onto the way out onto the floorboard out the uh, if not I'm touching the uh, heat shield on the exhaust on my left foot uh, or sorry my right foot and my left foot is pretty much touching the engine casing yeah I would definitely have to put some uh, floorboard extensions on this thing all right everybody uh, I'm gonna tune out uh, thanks for tuning in remember to please like and subscribe and uh, we'll catch you in the next one cheers